All right, I'm Mickey the Flight Nerd. Let's talk about calculating the maneuvering speed of your aircraft. So what is maneuvering speed, or VA? When exceeding the VA speed, full deflection of any flight control could actually damage the aircraft. The maneuvering speed of an aircraft uh, actually varies greatly depending on the current weight of the aircraft. So this VA limit that we need to worry about actually decreases when the plane is lighter. So if you think about it, you'll have to be more careful about full control deflection at uh, slower speeds when the plane is lighter. The opposite also holds true. Heavier planes uh, have a higher VA speed, which is better. We don't have to worry about full control deflection uh, until a higher speed is reached in heavier aircraft. Of course, this only holds true for VA. Usually, if the plane is heavier, uh, it means worse performance. Think about stall speed or takeoff distance, for instance. The formula for VA is this. Current maneuvering speed equals maneuvering speed at maximum weight, which you can find in your POH, times the square root of the current weight over the maximum weight. So let's work through an example and calculate our maneuvering speed. Let's say we have a Cessna 152 that has a VA at max gross weight of 104 knots of indicated airspeed. If the current weight of the plane is 1,500 pounds, we divide that by the max gross weight, uh, which is uh, 1,670 pounds for C-152s. We take that result and compute its square root and multiply that number times our original VA, which was 104. The result is 98.6, which rounds up to a VA of 99 for a C-152 at 1,500 pounds. So that's it. Now we know how to uh, figure the maneuvering speed of an aircraft. Thanks so much for watching, and if uh, this video helped you out in any way, please subscribe and like. Till next time.